Hey guys, what's going on? This is Formation Adventures, and today I'm going to talk about my trip to the Marsh Billings Rockefeller National Historical Park. But before we continue, please press the like button, smash the subscribe button, and make sure you click on the bell to turn on all notifications so you won't miss out on any of my posts. In the spring of 2021, I took a trip to Woodstock, Vermont to see the Marsh Billings Rockefeller National Historical Park, one of the places underneath the National Park Service. In this park, there's a mansion along with the historical farm, which at first belonged to George Perkins Marsh, one of the nation's first global environmental thinkers who grew up in this house and area. Later on, the mansion will be home to Frederick Billings, a famous American lawyer who established a progressive dairy farm and a better way of farming, also was a conservationist. After Frederick Billings passed away, the mansion, farm, and property will be owned by Lawrence S. Rockefeller and his wife, Mary F. Rockefeller, who is the granddaughter of Frederick Billings. These people were part of the Rockefeller family lineage, who were one of the most richest, powerful, and most influential people at one time in American history. Eventually, the Rockefellers donated the mansion, the farm, and the land to the National Park Service. This was a Belvedere I saw a good distance behind the mansion. Just like the mansion, I wasn't able to go inside, but on the inside, there's a bowling alley, a greenhouse on the rear, and a swimming pool next to it. There have been many items and equipment used in the historical farm in times past. One of them, and the most interesting from the rest of them, was this horse treadmill, in which a horse would operate the treadmill by walking on it, and in the process would grind and mill food produce. All right, when I wrap this video up, if you like adventure, press the like button, subscribe to my channel, and turn on all notifications. Till then, I'll see you in another video. Thank you for watching.